As the number one renewable energy resource for homeowners, it's no wonder that solar panels continue to become so popular. But if you're new to the world of solar panel systems, have no fear. The Energy Professor is here to be your guide. In this video, we are going to cover everything you need to know if you're considering switching to solar panels. Here at the Energy Professor, we want to give you the information that you need to not only save money on your energy bill, but to also become more energy efficient. We hope you find this video helpful. Be sure to check out our solar tool in the description below to calculate how much you could save at your address by switching to solar panels. All you need to do is enter your home or business address, select your property type, then select your estimated average monthly electric bill, and that's it. Our tools will calculate the upfront cost after incentives, 20-year benefits, tax incentives, the total 20 year savings, and how many years it will take for you to get paid back from installing your solar panels. You will also be able to see the savings no matter if you're looking to buy, lease, or loan your solar panel system. You can get all of this plus a free quote over at theenergyprofessor.com. So first things first, what are solar panels? Solar panels are devices that convert sunlight into electricity. They're made up of many smaller units called solar cells. Typically, these cells are made from silicon, a semiconductor material. When light hits these cells, it triggers a chemical reaction that produces electricity. Now, let's go over the five ways on how solar panels work. Number one, absorption of light. When sunlight strikes the solar panels, the solar cells absorb photons, or light particles. This energy is what powers the entire process. The amount of sunlight hitting the panels directly affects the amount of energy produced. Number two, creation of electric current. The absorbed sunlight excites electrons in the silicon atoms within the solar cells. This excitation allows the electrons to break free from their atoms, creating an electric current. These cells are designed with a positive and negative layer, creating an electric field that directs these free electrons toward metal conductive plates. Number three, inversion of current. The electric current generated by solar cells is direct current, or DC. However, most home appliances and electrical grids use alternating current, or AC. Therefore, the DC electricity flows to an inverter, which converts it to AC electricity. This is a crucial step for integrating solar energy into your home's electrical system. Number four, storage and usage. Once that energy is converted to AC, the electricity can then be used to power your home's appliances, lights, and other electrical devices. Any excess energy not immediately used can often be sent back to the grid or stored in batteries for later use, providing energy during non-sunny periods or at night. And number five, net metering. If your solar panel system generates more electricity than you consume, many utility companies allow for net metering. This means that you can receive credits on your electricity bill for the surplus energy that is sent back to the grid, further offsetting your energy costs. Now there are three types of solar panels that exist today, and they are monocrystalline solar panels. These are made from a single cell structure. These panels are often known for their high efficiency and longevity. They also tend to perform better in low light conditions. Polycrystalline solar panels. These are made from multiple silicon crystals and generally are less expensive, but slightly less efficient than monocrystalline panels. And lastly, we have thin film solar panels. These panels are lightweight and flexible, making them suitable for a variety of applications. However, they usually have a lower efficiency and require more space. Now before we come to an end, let's discuss some of the top benefits of installing a solar panel system for your home. Renewable energy source. Solar energy is abundant and sustainable. Reduced electricity bills. By generating your own electricity, you can lower your monthly electric costs. Environmental impact. Solar energy reduces reliance on fossil fuels, lowering carbon emissions. And energy independence. Producing your own energy can provide greater security against rising electricity costs. Understanding how solar panels work is the first step towards harnessing the sun's power for your energy needs. As technology continues to evolve, solar energy becomes an increasingly viable option for homeowners and business owners alike. Whether you're considering a solar installation or just curious about renewable energy, embracing solar power is a step toward a sustainable future.
And if you're looking for more ways to increase the energy efficiency and sustainability in your home, be sure to take a look at all the latest renewable energy options in your area. The Energy Professor helps residential and small business owners find qualified energy suppliers in New York, New Jersey, Pennsylvania, Texas, Ohio, Maryland, Illinois, and Massachusetts. Thank you so much for watching, happy savings, and we'll see you in the next video.